Hi everyone, this is James from Cruise West Coast again, and today I'm going to share with you five great places on Catalina that cruise visitors should try for lunch when they visit the island. One of the challenges that I've always had when visiting Catalina is that while there are some very good places to eat, it is a resort island where everything is very expensive, and too often you only have one chance to get it right when it comes to finding a good place to eat. This unfortunately has led many people, including ourselves, to wrongly believe that there is no good food to be had here. Unfortunately, this often happens in places like Avalon, since first place you see when walking down Crescent Ave. Aren't always the best, and many tour companies have partnerships with venues that they can recommend in exchange for getting discounts themselves. Local favorites and hidden gems, however, are often found one block back or at the end of the road and don't always have the need to promote themselves or have the ability to spend money on expensive marketing. Thankfully, though, Heather and I had the chance to spend some time exploring the island a few weeks ago, and we have some new favorites that we're ready to share with you. First up is Naughty Fox. Located in Avalon, this restaurant offers a unique dining experience with its outdoor patio and cozy atmosphere. They serve up delicious seafood dishes like their famous poke nachos, fish tacos, and lobster BLT. Don't forget to grab some cocktails, too. They make some of the best libations found anywhere in Avalon. Next is NDMK Fish House. This restaurant is located just off of Crescent Ave and serves up some of the freshest seafood around. From their signature fish and chips to grilled, fried, or blackened local catch of the day, you can't go wrong with anything on the menu here. Third on the list is Blue Water Grill. This restaurant chain has been serving up fresh seafood since 1996 in Newport Beach and is known for its amazing views of the harbor. If you are looking to warm up with a delicious cup of clam chowder, this is where you should go. Fourth is the Lobster Trap. Located off of Catalina Ave, just short of a block from Crescent Ave, this is absolutely a local's favorite. Don't worry though, tourists and other visitors are more than welcome to stop by for hearty portions of local seafood and pasta dishes. Plus, as you would expect from a restaurant like this on Catalina Island, they've got some great drinks here too. Last but not least is Catalina Island Brew House. This brewery offers craft beer made right on the island as well as lunchtime favorites like pretzels, cakes, cookies, sandwiches, and flatbread pizzas. Our local friends tell us to make sure we let people know to skip Starbucks. This is also the best coffee shop on the island, as well as the best place to grab a pizza. So there you have it. Five great places on Catalina Island that cruise visitors should try for lunch when they visit the island. I hope you found this video helpful. Do you have a favorite spot to eat on Catalina Island? Let us know in the comments below.